it's good practice to define a permanent geometric tolerance in diamonds. This will allow you to easily identify locations with double points and resolve them. And by double points, I mean points at small distances from one another. Keep in mind that for a structural analysis model, points only at few centimeters from each other are not relevant. In order to have a good analysis model, they should be eliminated. This is part of the schematization, turning a real-life model into a proper analysis model. The geometric tolerance can be set at Options, Preferences, in the tab page Model. And I set the geometric tolerance to 3 cm. Why 3 cm? Actually, any value between 3 or 5 cm is a good value. This value is chosen on what you can distinct with the naked eye. Points closer than 3 cm are difficult to distinct. Points that are further away than 5 cm are usually noticed by the user and can be fixed manually. This value will be stored in the general settings of diamonds and will be available for all models that you open or create. And I hit OK. When you run the elastic analysis, Diamonds will perform a geometry verification and alert the user when there are points that are closer to each other than the set tolerance of, in my case, 3 cm. It is impossible to continue with the calculation. We get the message, impossible to calculate structure, a few points are too close. And I click OK. Something went wrong while verifying the structure and I hit Yes. It is very important now that you do not click anywhere within the drawing area. Diamonds has selected the problem points for you, although you cannot see them right now. What you need to do is click show selection only. What is left are the double points. We can now take a closer look and decide how to solve them. I'm taking a closer look we see that the structure is not connected. Over here, well, I cannot even perform the correct zoom operation. These points are um, even closer to each other than I can zoom. Now, there are two ways to fix this. There is an automatic fix or a manual fix. The manual way is to modify the geometry by deleting points or bars or using the translation function, etc. This gives you full control over all changes to the model. However, this takes more time and you can only fix the problems you see. The automatic way is to use the structure verification. You select the whole model and let diamonds join points that are closer to each other than the set tolerance. Downside is that you do not have full control over the changes so you do not know which point will be kept in the joining operation. But, on the other hand, this function will also solve problems that are not visible with the naked eye, so the problems that you cannot see, and is very, very fast. In my case over here, it's recommended to use the automatic structure verification. I first make the whole model visible, I select the whole model, and choose structure verification. The same tolerance is used over here and I hit OK. I can now calculate the model and the analysis will start without any problem.